All right, Al Kazam, welcome back, race fans. Uh, quick look here uh, at Gulfstream Park, Wednesday, January 4th, 2023 now, and a huge upset right off the bat. Let's look at the payouts here. Uh, we had uh, the one horse, Matize, uh, with jockey Lionel Reyes, that horse went off at uh, 20 to 1 morning line. Uh, $2 ticket paid $98.80. So that means it went off at about uh, plus 4,700 uh, or 47 to 1, as you might say. Um, look at the payouts. Came in 1653 and then uh, the, uh, again, $98 on the $2 win ticket, $5.80 on the place and four dollars and sixty cents on the show. Uh, the uh, vertical exotics. We had the two dollar superfecta paid sixteen thousand seven hundred and sixty one. Super high five paid zero, so nobody must have hit it. Uh, there was two thousand one hundred in the pool. It says so. I guess that went to the house or carryover. Uh, trifecta was. Um, 165 paid 2441 on a $2 try and a $2 uh exacta paid uh $528 so big win again this was a uh, jockey Lionel Reyes on the big win on Matize the 6 horse uh Luis Saez on downburst the 5 horse rather 6 horse was Rich Gift with Jorge Ruiz as the uh, jock. Luis Saez had the mount on the uh, show horse, which was the five horse down burst. I'm just going to scroll down so you can get a uh, look at the uh, rest of the horses and prices. And let's get to the race. Ten horse race with one scratch uh, being the ten horse. Horses one to nine in play. Turf is firm, and we're set for a start. R Racing at Goldstream. Off a step slow, both Marilyn and Kiss Upon a Star. Down at the inside, Mites was away quickly and reaches out for the early lead from Rich Gift, who comes away in second. Downburst is maneuvered down toward the rail to race from third. Down at the fence goes Country Jewel and out a bit wide on the course, Inez's hats. Working between them and only about four lengths behind is Lynn Pier. Up and around horses goes Marilyn, then Kiss Upon a Star, and Reaching Stride is last. They reach the top of the backstretch with Mites and Leonel Reyes at a big number. They beat by a length and a half over Rich Gift in a flanking position second. Four wide is Marilyn, just inside her Inez's hats. Downburst getting shuffled back a touch with Lynn Pier alongside. And it's a length and a half to Country Jewel with Kiss Upon a Star, and still at the back is Reaching Stride. Four and a half furlongs from the finish. Mites a length and a quarter. Inez's Hats is forcing Rich Gift to go if she wants to keep her spot. Downburst is ridden into fourth. Then back to Lynn Pier, wide on the course in Maryland. Kiss Upon a Star tries to play catch up with an inside lane. Reaching strides out of last, and now the trailer is Country Jewel. They run around the far turn to the top of the stretch. Rich Gift within a neck of Mites, who still holds command. Downburst is a ridden third. At the rail, it's Lynn Pier. Kiss Upon a Star is plummeted to last. Off the turn in the stretch drive, Mites still has the lead. Ruiz trying to get Rich Gift to shift gears, and she's closing a bit of ground. From between horses, here's a late run from Reaching Stride. Reaching Stride surges between. At the rail, Mites from the outside downburst. Here's the line photo finish. That's a wicked photo, and it's three across the course. Mites inside, downburst outside, Rich Gift between. Reaching Stride's fourth in 130 and three. So, close race there. But uh, actually, that one kind of looked like the one horse took it. Let's roll down here to race five to see what the uh, pick four and pick five paid for posterity's sake. Uh, that wouldn't have affected the pick four, but it obviously affected the pick five on race one. So, here's the race five. Uh, three, two, one, eight. All right, let's take a look. So, <laughs> P 
pick pick five. So I'm assuming that's the pick five, all five places, and this is the pick five. I don't know what they've they've quoted that twice there. So it says in this top one, looks like they've got one, six, eight, two, or five, or three. Uh, so three hundred eight thousand dollars in the pool, and the two dollar ticket paid forty three thousand. Uh, so I guess that means uh, there was about seven winners with that huge long shot in there. That's that's one heck of a pick five on a two dollar ticket, forty three thousand. See what it says on TVG. So TVG, <clears throat> this will be quoted uh, as a one dollar. The one dollar pick for four was two eighty eight. That was unaffected by race one. So the pick, the the one dollar pick five four or five paid seventy three dollars and twenty cents. It was one six eight two or five, and then the three horse in the last race. So the $1 pick five was one, six, eight, two or five, and the three. And they're saying 21843 So that's right. That's about half of what the $2 quote was. So oddly enough, they don't tell you the total pool here on this page. So, so, so $21,000 pick five. So apparently there were some winners. We'll leave it to that, Alcazam race fans.